Hi guys and welcome to 123MyT's video on why Mac users should now be looking to download OSX El Capitan. Okay guys, so I just want to talk a little bit about the new um, version of Mac OS. I won't actually go into how it all works, but there's a new version of Mac OS X which will be released shortly called Sierra. Now the issue here is you will be asked to upgrade and it, it is a free upgrade so it's not really a problem. The issue is, is, is if you ever want to downgrade or move back to OS X El Capitan, you won't be able to get the older version of uh, OS X unless you go ahead now and download it. So I'll show you the 123MyIT website. Um, on here I created a video um, last year about how to download El Capitan. So if you go across to the 123MyIT website and you type in El Capitan in the top menu and then just hit enter, and then you'll get a few things here. So the first one here is uh, OSX El Capitan USB installer. So what this means is after you download OSX, either El Capitan or any version, you'll be able to then put it on a USB and you'll be able to do a clean install whenever you want. Okay, so the idea is that if you don't download a copy of El Capitan, then Apple will eventually remove the download link from their website when they release the new version of OSX and you will never be able to keep that or reinstall that old version. So it's very important that you try downloading the, uh, the old version now. Now there's a video here on how to do it. I'll show you real quick. You go open up your app store, type in OSX El Capitan, and then you hit your get symbol. You log in to the app store and then you download it. Now you don't have to create a USB for it. Um, you can just simply download the software so at least you have a copy of it. If you ever need to roll back the version of OSX from, from Sierra, then you'll have a copy of uh, El Capitan. But guys, do this now because maybe in uh, November, something like that, there'll be the new release, Sierra out, and then you, you always want to have a copy for yourself of the older operating system. I've actually got copies going right back to, I've got a Snow, Snow Leopard on USB, I've got Mavericks, I've got Yosemite, which is the one before El Capitan, and, and I've also got El Capitan. So, so it's really good to keep um, old versions of this operating system if you ever need to roll back or do a clean install. Okay guys, so um, jump over to the 123MyIT website and have a, have a look at those two there. Create yourself, either download um, El Capitan and then go ahead if you want to create yourself a USB. Okay guys, so that's pretty much it from me. If this was helpful, please leave a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and thanks for watching guys. Bye bye.